Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel once again. This is Tech PBA. So in this video tutorial, I'm going to take you through how to connect to another computer, another PC on your local area network or on your network remotely. If you want to sit in your office or your workspace and then connect remotely to another computer on your network and manage it, operate it, you, you want to be watching this video to know how to do that so the first thing you want to do is to make sure to go through some prerequisites make sure those prerequisites are in place before you can connect to another computer remote so what we are going to do is to we will move to the computer we will be connecting to and then we'll go through the prerequisites so let's get into it so this is the computer we are going to connect to so we'll call it um, pc2 so over at PC2, um, you want to open Explorer. First of all, you need to check that uh, this computer is discoverable over, over the network. So in File Explorer, on the left side where you see Network, right click on it and go to Properties. In the Properties window, click on, go ahead and then click on Change Advanced Sharing Options. And just, just make sure that under Guest and Public, um, networks the turn on network discovery is enabled by default or is enabled if it's not enabled um, you can enable it also check it for private networks make sure that the turn on network discovery is enabled and that is the first prerequisite we'll go through and also um, you can right click on this PC go to properties and then in the properties window click on modes desktop and then under remote desktop settings just make sure that the enable remote desktop um, radio button is selected so make sure that this radio button is on and that it is not off again you can right click on this pc go to properties again and then click on advanced system settings on the right when you click on it and then the pop-up window comes up you can then click on remotes and then just make sure that this option is selected the allow remote connections to this computer sub um, option also selected and then you can just click ok just make sure that those options are selected and then we can continue so once you have those prerequisites out of the way the next thing you want to do is and i, I need to mention that you can connect to a pc over the network in two ways you can either use the host name of that pc or you can use the ip address of that pc so what i'm going to do is we are going to check both the host name and then the ip address of this pc which is the pc2 which is the pc we are going to connect to so to do that in the search box type cmd now once this once the command prompt comes up just go ahead and then click on it so to check the host name of this pc just type host name and then that is the host name of this particular pc we are going to connect to also to check the ip address um, of this same pc you can type the command ip config and hit enter and then you should see the IP address of this particular PC. So like I made mention before, you can either connect using the IP address of the PC or you can connect using the host name of the PC. So we'll try both ways and see. So I'll quickly minimize this one. Once you have all your prerequisites, done, um, we'll go to PC1 and try the connection from. So back on PC1, what you need to do to connect to the, 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 the remote computer, which is um, in this case PC2, is in the search box, we are going to type run, R-U-N, which is the run dialog box. And once it comes up, just go ahead and then click on it. And then once that comes up, go ahead and then type M-S-T-S-C, M-S-T-S-C, and then go ahead and then click OK to open the terminal there. so once um, you have the the console open go ahead and then type the host name we are going to connect first using the host name so see so yeah. 
and then I'll click the connect button once that is up I'll type the, the username so guys you have to know the username and then the password to log into that piece go ahead and then type the password as well And once you have the username and the password typed out, you can then click OK. And then this um, security um, certificates um, pop up will pop up. Just click yes to connect. And then you should be able to connect to the remote PC. And then when you look up here, you see that you will see this bar up here, which means that you are connected to this particular PC remotely. And then you can do all that you want to do on that uh, remote computer. Let's also try using the IP address. When we did it, the IP address was uh, 23192.168. So, so go into the search box again and type RUN, which is run. Click on it. From here, we can click type MSTSC. Go ahead and click OK. And then in the computer box, I will type the IP address 68.0.23. I will click Connect. I will go ahead and then type the password. Once again, click Yes. So now we can also see that uh, we are connected to this computer, which is PC2, using the IP address. Yes, guys, this has been a video tutorial on how to connect remotely to a, a PC over the same network or over another network. So kindly click on the subscribe button down this video to subscribe to my channel. Click on the like button if you enjoyed watching this video. Share this video and I will see you in another video. Bye.